the qualities I possess in becoming an effective teacher are excellent interpersonal skills. And I say this because having a strong relationship with your students pushes them to do their best. Back when I was doing my, pra my two weeks of practicum, I met an amazing and brilliant student named Rochelle. Our communication was amazing. It was really great working with her. She was really open-minded and she was very accept she was ac she accepted the information that was poured out to her. And after my two weeks practicum, I met her again and her exact words were, "Miss, you were the one that made me do so well in first class." So the, so the moral of this story is having a great interpersonal skills pushes your students to do their best however I don't just want it to be building a bond with them I want them to come to me in a difficult time when they feel uncertain about something even when they feel like an outsider not only inside of the classroom This goes hand in hand with building strong relationships and bond with your students. Two, excellent communication skills that enables me to interact not only just with my colleagues, but also the parents and the students as well. According to research, it shows that having great communication with the parents students benefit from that and this goes to show that when a parent and a and a teacher communicates they share permanent information about that student which pushes them to help the students reach their academic success I'll, three Along with being a strong facilitator, I do believe I also excel in teaching my students respect, teaching my, my students to show respect to others. My strong passion is inspiring and motivating my students to achieve their academic success. I do not think the word cannot exist. With my strong motivating abilities, I know my motto, every child can, will inspire my students to achieve great things. Three, I have great empathy. And when I say the word empathy, it means a lot to me. So during my two weeks practicum experience, I recall working with a student who was going going through a tough tough moment I was truly worried for her and one day I pulled her aside to to learn more of what was going on and I learned her difficult circumstances and with my 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 empathy I gave her substantial information what to do how to go about handling this situation and also letting her speak to a guidance counselor and after that her views on me changed a whole lot she even showed me more respect for the remainder of my stay at the institution so in my own words having Having empathy drives a student to, to learn. And for me, teachers who practice empathy teaches their students um, to, to have empathy as well. And this helps students feel safe and welcome inside and outside the classroom, which in turn helps to build a stronger classroom community. And those are the four qualities I possess that would make me become an effective teacher.